Hello everyone! In this video I will show you how to add app tracking transparency pop-up inside your game. This is required starting with iOS 14.5. To begin, I have here a simple scene that displays an ad when you click a button. Now I will add the built-in iOS required pop-up for my ad implementation. For that, go to Window Package Manager and search for iOS 14 Advertising Support and import it inside your project. Import the sample scene. Open the sample scene and hit play. You will notice a pop-up in which it is explained why you need the app tracking for. This pop-up is optional, but it is good to have for providing a better description to users about why you need the tracking for. You can customize this prefab in any way you want. When you click Next on an iOS device, the native tracking pop-up will be displayed, but currently on Editor nothing happens. To make this pop-up functional, I will make it load the first scene from your game. To do that, add this scene as the first scene inside your build settings. Open Context Screen Manager script. As you can see, this displays the context pop-up if it was not already displayed. Apple requires that the tracking pop-up to be displayed only once when your app first runs. Now I will make the scene to wait until an option is selected and then load the next scene from the build settings. I will use a coroutine to wait. Wait until the status changes and then load the next scene. This code should run only on iOS, on other platforms will throw errors so I will condition it. If I test it, it will not run inside Unity Editor because the native pop-up from iOS will only be displayed on device. So I will make this code running only on a real device by using Unity Editor Directive. As you can see, now the scene is loaded inside the editor. The official Unity documentation provides a script that automatically sets all required properties inside Xcode, so no manual setup will be needed from your part. I will provide the link in the description. Create a folder called Editor and a new script inside it. Paste the content from the Unity documentation. This text will be displayed inside the native tracking pop-up, so you can change it based on your needs. All is done now. I will build and run the project. This is how it looks like on an iOS device. After you click Next, the native tracking pop-up is shown and after you choose an option, the first scene of your app is loaded. As you can see, the ads are working. This project is available on GitHub. Check the link in the description. Thank you for watching.